everyone how's it going it's brooklyn with j lorraine studio if you're new to my channel welcome if you're returning welcome back it is 2022 this video is kind of late because this weekend this new year's weekend has been um i'm gonna just say a lot so i am planning kind of late but it's okay better late than never as you guys will see i am back in my classic as things are getting busy now that i'm back to work running three businesses and going to school so i need all the space even though i am using this i am still using my digital planner but sometimes it's good to write stuff down so that's what this is for even though my digital planner will be the main one because that's the one that i carry around with me i use um good notes so i'm able to see it on my computer as well as my phone and my ipad but let's jump right in this is from notique i just started setting it up this right here is from the Peach Palmetto. This is from um, Villa Beautiful. This is from Gold Mine and Coco. This is the HP cover. This right here is from Paper and Alley. Peach Palmetto. This is from my shop. This was in my shop also. This is a vellum that I made. And this is an inbox one that I made where I put my little stickies. Um, I am using this four month daily page layout. So this is what I'll use for the dailies. And then for my weekly, I have this from Lights Planner, Lights Planner Action. And I chose this, I think it's called the executive layout. Um, I like it because with work, it's a lot of listing of to do's, um, and stuff like that, like task wise with the position that I'm in. So this will be, I'm not gonna say it's the, it will be the best layout to use, but I'm definitely gonna try it out for the month of January and see how that goes. And for this week, I'm going to use this. I was hoarding it. I'm not gonna lie. I was hoarding these stickers because these are beautiful and probably my favorite. And these are from Goldmine and Coco. This is from Planaholic. I really love the color palette. Yeah, I was really gonna pour these babies. But I think I'm going to use, hmm. So it's gonna be between these two. I think this one would be better because this one is more for like home. So I think this one would be better along with some of these stickers. So I'm gonna pull these out and then we will get started. I don't think I'm going to decorate my daily so much because it's a lot with work. I am the sales analyst as well as um, a property administrator for a new Hilton property that's opening. So I'm doing my job as well as others, you know, hybrids. When you're working for a new property, um, it's, it's a lot different, not, not the whole team is there. So, you know, there's some more shared responsibilities. So that's why I need more of this. To be honest with you, this might just be work and my digital planner will be my catch all. Um, let's see, so I need my tweezers, my scissors. Um, so first what I'm gonna do is lay down the days of the week and since, um, I don't work on the weekends. I'll probably use these here to cover these up for like um, maybe next week, following week or projects. So I did also have this in a A5 size. Um, I'm not sure if it's too small or not. So that's why I wanted to try this because I did try the, not A5, sorry, half letter. I did try that out and um, it was okay. I'm not sure if we'll be able to hold everything. So that's why I'm also gonna try this in tandem with the half letter. So enough gibbering. I'm gonna go ahead and put these down.
Okay, so I see that this is gonna be a little bit too big for this spot right here, so it might have to come down here. So let's try and find something else there. Actually, these will, actually, there's four of these. So I'll use them across right here. Okay, so for up here, I might need to use some deco. Let's see. Like maybe. Maybe this right here. It might be too long. Okay, so the adhesive was something else on this. This new stick of paper, yeah. It's always good to have undo just in case, but I was able to get it off. Okay. All right, we're back in business. Um, I am going to place her over here. She's definitely one of my favorite dolls from the Planaholic collection. Actually, before I lay her down, I do want to put her sticker over here. Let's see. I'm going to use this one right here. Now it's just time to put down some deco. Um, I'm not gonna put too much just because this week is actually pretty busy. You never know, I might end back end up back in my half letter. Um, things have been very volatile, but up and down, so it's not always it's not always a busy week, and that's why I like undated planners, so I'm not stuck with the date. So this helps. And I love being able to jump in between different planners when they're undated. I love being able, okay, this month I might do A5, this month I might do half letter, this month might be classic. That's why I love undated planning, undated planners.
I like layering, so that's why I'm putting this over here. Um, I'm probably going to add some of the deco on top of this also. This one I'm going to layer over here. But I'm trying to figure out these are repeated um, so I think I'm gonna put task over here and these I think I'm going to use for each um, each director, I'll use a box for them specifically. a little bit of deco and I'm not gonna use these because I have enough note space. I think I'm gonna use these two. I don't think I want another doll on here. So I'm gonna use these two. Right here seems a little bland. It seems like everything is to the side, which is normally um, okay for me because most of the work happens between Tuesday and a Thursday. Monday is usually when I'm at work and I'm setting up for the week and Friday, most of my stuff is already done. So I think I'll use this one. some neutral florals actually wait I think I made huh let's check the um I'm thinking maybe check my flower power book first and then huh let's see this right here is the flower power and then I think I have neutral florals somewhere else. Uh, this might work because of this might work because of this right here. a hundred percent how I feel about it just yet um, 
do want to check another book. Let's see. So I want to take a look at these two. This is Martin Year and Sophisticated Florals. To be honest, I might just end up using the black. If I have any left, like these right here. Oh, wow, wait, the rose gold will look pretty too, though. I think that rose gold will look pretty. Oh, wait, I did forget to put down my check boxes. Let's see. So I mainly need it for Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and I do have enough. See, now this may have gotten in the way. So I might have to cut one down for that one. That's fine. Okay, that looks great. Now, florals, I think I'm gonna use the rose gold. Everything is so heavy up here. I'm just trying to figure out. But also, like, I really, really love layering, so I think I'm gonna put it right here. Right, there we go and now that I noticed I had more um, now that I realized I had this book it might be some things I can add from here over so I do have an appointment 
on Friday. So I'll put that here. I'm gonna appointment with a vendor on this day. So this looks like it might fit in the box. Oh, that actually might fit perfectly. So I put something over here. Oh no. It's between these two. I'll use this one. Let's see, so it's perfect in height. So there seems like there's a little space, so try to put it right in the middle. Almost. Let's see if there's anything else I want to add. I do like the, the rose gold will match with the flowers. trying to remember not to put too much on here because it is for work. And I think this this should suffice for the week. I think this came out great so let's pop this back, back in my planner. And there we are, we are all set for the week of January 3rd. Again, these were stickers by Go Mine and Coco, as well as the Happy Planner. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Until next time, bye.